All right, kids, you are really going to love these Cornish game hens I cooked for dinner. Now, I don't want to pat myself on the back, but I worked all day getting them just right. Holy crap! Oh, my God! Then that means... And that also means... You know what, Peter? You tried hard, and you still earned that wine. I'm home! Wow, Peter, the house looks amazing. Yeah, well, let's take off our shoes and try to keep it that way, huh? Not really, Peter. It seems like you've really taken to being a house husband. Well, it hasn't been easy. Between doing the laundry and vacuuming, I barely had time to put on a nice sweater and clasp a cup of tea with two hands. And now to tie this sweater around my waist and walk around the neighborhood. Well, what do you say I reward you for all your hard work? Jeez, Lois, is that all you think about? I'm tired. Come on, Peter. I need this release. I had a long day at work. Oh, work. I suppose work is why you missed Chris's father-son picnic. Peter, you're still Chris's father. Why can't you just listen instead of trying to fix everything? Get in here, Peter. Don't you want to have sex? I don't think we've done it since I started working. Yeah, I guess you're right. Come on. Where's my big, strong man? Putting on one of your dress shirts to look sexy? Mm, I want to do it on top of the comforter. I don't care if we make streaks. Well, of course you don't. You're not the one who cleans it. Peter, just shut up and take me. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> Peter, get up! Get up! There's a caterpillar in the bed! Oh, that's, uh, that's me. What? How do I put this delicately? My hog cannot partake in the slop this evening. Peter, are you having trouble getting ready? Yes, obviously I'm having trouble. Well, somebody's got to have sex with me. Lois, don't say that. Quagmire will show up like the roadrunner. <laughs> it's okay. Your vagina's just a painted-on hole. Peter, you're up. That's not what I heard. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Peter, you want a little something to put in that orange juice? What? Why? It's 9 a.m. Well, I figured you'd like to start your day with a stiff one. <laughs> <laughs> you can't get a boner! You're a failure as a man and a father! Peter, it's nothing to get upset about. There's treatments available. Well, go see Dr. Hartman. I don't want to do that. I'm embarrassed. This shouldn't embarrass you. The size should embarrass you. 